why? So you know what's awkward? When someone says something like, I've been told that I look like Angelina Jolie. Oh yeah, I, I can kind of see. Kind of see that you're crazy. And for the most part, it usually goes down like that. But then every now and then, this happens. You know, Sarah looks like Jessica Alba sometimes. Oh yeah, I can see. Yeah, see that you're crazy. No, no, I'm serious and we can hear you. If, if you look at her from behind, from the side, she looks like Jessica Alba, but only from behind, from the side. It's really weird, but apparently, if I turn my back and then look just over my shoulder on the side. Oh my God. Really? I can't see Yeah, it. no, for sure. No, absolutely. You 100% look like, oh. Oh, you must have moved a bit because it's gone now. Oh, it's gone? Oh, yeah, it's gone, it's gone. You gotta turn more, turn more. Yeah, no, 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 it's back, it's back. 100%. Dark angel. Well, perhaps I'm being a little bit too generous in that rendition, but you know what I mean, right? How people only look like a celebrity from a certain angle or in certain light. For example, I sometimes look like Megan Fox. Check this out. From the side, now you have to squint. Yeah, squint a little bit more, a little bit more, a little more. Now close your eyes completely. Think about Megan Fox. Bam. Don't I look like her? Yeah, you can open your eyes again. But you guys know what I mean, right? And the worst thing is when someone says they look like a celebrity and they don't, then you kind of lie by picking out a feature on their face and saying it reminds you of the celebrity. I know it's crazy, but everyone says I look like her, especially in the Mr. and Mrs. Smith phase. You know what? I think it's the eyes. You have Angelina Jolie's eyes. When I really want to say... I know it's crazy, but everyone says I look like her, especially in the Mr. and Mrs. Smith phase. You know what? It's this part of the face. Just here, that little square there. That square on your face looks the same. Like, like this? No, here, no, not that like big. Here? Just this small one here. No, no, smaller. Small, smaller. Yeah. Left, left, right, oh, right, too far. No, split the difference. Bingo. Mr. and Mrs. Smith. But it does make me wonder sometimes when, you know, we sit around saying, you remind me of this celebrity or you remind me of that. Do you think celebrities sit around doing the same thing with normal people? Oh my God, it's so great being famous. Oh my God, Mindy. What? For a moment, you look like the lady at my local grocery store. It was crazy. Are you serious? Actually, you know what? I've been told that I look like the lady from the post office. Oh yeah, I see. <laughs> see that you're crazy. And on the odd occasion that I've been told that I remind someone of a celebrity, they always like to throw in the version of the celebrity that I remind them of. You remind me of an ugly version of so-and-so. Thanks. Or they tell me I look like so-and-so's cousin. You could be so-and-so's cousin. I could be anyone's cousin. That's crazy. But it does make me feel a little bit better. See, I have been told more than once that I remind people of Jackie Chan. It could be a racist thing because Jackie Chan's an Asian man, but it does make me feel a little bit better, like I could do martial arts. You know, Nat, sometimes you remind me of Jackie Chan. Oh, really? Why would you say that? My awesome strength? Oh, look, how convenient for this kind of moment. Yeah! Fuck! I think it's more the eyes. I think you have Jackie Chan's eyes. So do a lot of us, but let me know in the comments below. Do you ever get told that you remind people of a celebrity or do you have a friend who reminds you of a celebrity? And does it involve restrictions? For example, you know, I look like her from the side or she looks like her, but only from a certain angle. Let me know below. And apologies about this video being late. As I mentioned before, summer and spring get a little bit busy for me. But if you follow me on Twitter and Facebook, you can keep up to date with all the awesome stuff I'm doing. Yeah, we are. So please make sure you do. And also thank you for your comments in my last video, which was about inventing already invented stuff, which has been the downfall of my plans to become a successful millionaire inventor. Yeah, I know, life's hard, but don't forget to let me know which celebrity you look like or your friend looks like, and I will see you guys in a week, and I hope you're well until then. Bye. Okay, it's Bonnie Music slash comment time, and Matthew, I love the idea of somebody reinventing socks, not shoes, just socks. And uh, Cal, I think uh, see-through toast has unfortunately already been invented, but it is incredibly expensive for something that just monitors your toast. And Dala, I like your conviction. You, you just want a shirt that is also pants. I think that's a jumpsuit. I'm sorry if I crushed your dreams, but uh, somebody was going to.